What's happening YouTube, your boy TechTrix back with another video and today we're going to show you how to change the icons on your iPhone. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you're notified of the next videos to come of tips and tricks on your iPhone and your Android. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. And here we go. And today I was able to change my icons on Big Sur. So I was able to get all the Big Sur icons on my iPhone. You can also download different icons on your iPhone via iOS 14. So that's pretty cool. I like how Apple was able to update the iOS 14 and added this feature on iOS 14. So I'll show you all today how to do that. So here we go. All you need to do is open up the Safari. Go to a website called uh, iSkinToolIPhone.net. I'll link this down below if you want to check that out. Make sure to hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. In this website, as you can see, you can see all the uh, icons that you want here. All you need to do is just pick one. So let's say, let's try out the avatar. Really cute um, icons there. That's pretty cool. So you can see the application icons. Go ahead and check that out. There you go, a bunch of different avatar icons. If you want to download that, all you need to do is click the check marks right there and generate theme. Once you've done that, it'll download the profile, press allow. And then all you need to do is go to settings, profile downloaded, install. Hit install, there you go, punch in your passcode, boom, and you're good to go. Once you've done that, all the icons will be on your home screen right there, and then you can rearrange it to however you like. Now all you need to do is open up music or different apps right there. So you can see there's a transition that we don't like so much right there. That little transition bugs me a little bit, so we can change that as well. All you need to do is go to settings so that you'll be able to change that. Go to accessibility right there. Go to motion and click reduce motion and press crossfade transition. Make sure to, in, make sure to turn that on. Once that's all done, you can check it out again. Press, hit the music and it'll go straight there. No more motion or any annoying little motions right there. So you're good to go. And there you go. We're able to change all the icons on our iPhone. Different icons you can download from this website. Again, the website will be linked down below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button below as well. Hit that like button so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful. Peace!